Science actually answers the myth of the five second rule. I'm not sure about you guys, but this is something I'm definitely excited to know the answer to. My name is Amber Smith, and welcome to IO. I want to know, do you follow the five second rule? You know, the one where you drop your food on the floor, five seconds, it's still good to eat. And if you don't follow it, does that change when you're alone? Let me know in the comment section down below. Paul Dawson, professor of food science at Clemson University, decided to put the Wooled Wives Tale to the test. And it turned up some surprising conclusions. To test this rule, he coated a variety of surfaces with a nasty salmonella bag and put a piece of bread down for 5, 30, and 60 seconds long. It was found that the amount of bacteria wasn't directly correlated to the amount of time that it was on the bread, but rather the fact that it touched the bread at all. In one counterintuitive research finding, it was actually found that carpet contains less bacteria, and it's said to be safer than tile or wood with the same bacteria dropped on it. So overall, if something you're eating hits the deck, your odds are pretty good that you're gonna live to tell about it. But if it's dropped on a contaminated surface, then you might not be so lucky. And that's where the gray area is. How are you supposed to know what's fully contaminated and what's safe? So now knowing all of this lovely scientific information, I wanna know again, do you abide by the five second rule? And would you, knowing what you know now? Let me know down below. If you eat food off the ground, I want you to hit that like button. We know Mike McCrudden will. My name is Amber Smith and thanks for checking out IO. For more trending stories from around the world, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe to our channel.